Does that mean we're on? That means we're on. That means we're on. Is there anybody up. else? It'll pop up one of the... It'll, it'll pop up. A, a little thing up there saying who's on. Or oh. how many people are on. So... Yeah. Uh, people are listening to that now? Oh, there's somebody right there. Now that means people are watching? Yep. What the hell's going on? Holy shit, there's a whole bunch of people. Damn, people are into this shit. Oh yeah, tell them what we just did. Well, we, what we just did is we did some drinking. And we had this right here. This is that teacher's uh, Highland Cream shit. We just drank some of that. Um, drank some stuff. The bottle is actually holding up the phone with the other stuff. Yeah. What the hell is it? It's slain, um, uh, slain Irish whiskey stuff. Yeah. That's what we just got done there. Well, people are, are they talking? And then the we reviewed uh, Labyrinth. Cher says, hey, hey, Cher, how you doing? Hey. Lisa, y'all rock that. You appreciate that, Lisa, and y'all. Ted's watching. Hey, Teddy. Miss Shea, ain't seen you in a while. Oh, uh, yeah. I'll see, Ted, are you going to be at the damn uh, Outsiders reunion thing coming up on the uh, 28th, I think? See, yeah, it's cool. You can ask questions. Um, hey, we did the uh, review of Labyrinth, and we watched David Bowie in, his, in those tight-ass pants. We just finished a... Ugh. David Bowie, I mean, he's a god amongst men, yes. He looked gay as hell in that movie. That's true. I mean, he's gay in real life, so I guess it matters. It don't matter. And we figured out that whole movie is just one big mushroom trip. That's right. So make sure, uh, as soon as we get that video up, you uh, check that out. Hey, Sammy. It's good to see you. How you doing? I ain't coming back to work for a while, so oh, whenever yeah. I get back, I'll see you. He said he's quitting. Hey, I wish I could quit. That'd be nice. Do this YouTube thing full time. I don't know. Depends on if I'm out of town filming. Well, Ted, here's the thing. Some things are more important than going outside of town filming and making a bunch of money. Or going outside even. <laughs> or just going outside. You can just stay inside. Hell, it don't matter none. Hey, you guys on there take showers or baths? Uh, put it down the cover. What the hell kind of question is well, that? I've just seen if any weird motherfuckers take bass out there. Uh, that's, that's a good question. I mean, I heard a rapper once say that he doesn't take bass because it's like sitting in your ass water. Yeah, it's true. It's just, it is exactly it true. It not make much sense. I'd buy that rapper's album because he's right. Hey, uh, well, we were doing the filming for the, um, what the hell was that called? Labyrinth? I was drinking this here. It's a strawberry daiquiri wine cooler. Now, I drank this because... It, in fact, is made with fruit. David Bowie, Bowie is, in fact, a fruit, or was, but we love him anyways. Yeah. So I drank that in honor of him. That doesn't mean a vegetable out there, people. That means something different. Only when it rains outside. What's that mean? That they take a bath. You can take a bath, or you shower when it rains outside. You take baths in your own filth. Well, if you're taking a bath when it's showering outside, is the tub filling up, or are you just... How the hell does that work? I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Well, if you're showering outside, you'd be showering there, if it was raining. There's no tub outside, though. You're just standing there in the rain. That's true. Where's El Slay at? El Slay ain't coming on here. He's got better things to do, like sleep. But, but you give and take a bath. I'm sorry. Well, it's okay. You're not weird. Well, now, if you have a big bucket outside, yeah, like a trough, a trough. And it fills up with rainwater. That's kind of like taking a bath. It is. It, well, you know, you it can take a little bit of sense. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. That's a touchy subject, I think. Maybe I shouldn't bring Why that up. Why the taking a bath a touchy subject? Because, you know, some, <laughs> some talk shit on bath takers. It's all right. You get them bath salts in there and stuff. Not the bath salts, but the, you know, relaxation bath salts. Yeah, what's that mean where it says invite right there? Um, You can invite them something. I, I don't know. I wouldn't touch it because I don't know what the fuck. Yeah, I don't does. know what it means either. Hey, Dustin. Hey, What's Becky. What's up? I ain't seen you in a while, Becky. Dustin, things are good. Things are good. I haven't bought anything for a while. You should be proud of me. I know well, the old lady ain't, ain't trying to kill me anymore because I haven't bought anything for a while. So that's good. Yeah. Oh, what's the invite thing? I need to know. What's the thumbs up thing? Do? Invite Jerry. See? Okay. <laughs> see what that does. Jerry, invite Jerry to be a guest. Oh, he could be Holy on the shit. video. What he this? Yeah, I don't want to do that because he might tell some secrets about me. Yeah. Yeah, he might be uh, lifting weights, get you know, yeah, yeah. flexing and stuff. Jerry, I'll see you Sunday, though. I mean, I don't really have a choice. I have to go. Because if not, I'd probably be castrated. Dustin says, good job. He's happy. He's proud of me. Oh, yeah. People are proud of me, I'm, Jim. I'm proud of you, too. Thank you. I appreciate you it. You said through that Labyrinth movie with me. Jesus. That was a little rough. If y'all get a chance to watch Labyrinth, I highly recommend it. 
just don't do it sober because yeah it's a lot easier to understand when you're not sober and if you does ever, that make sense? It does. And okay. if, if you want to do drugs, don't do drugs out there. Just watch Labyrinth, and um, it'll be enough to show you what drugs are all about. That's a good point. Hey, uh, we got Louie here. Louie's joining us. Yep. He's a little lab rat. Yeah, he's been shitting all over the place, but we don't hold that against him. <laughs> you know, I have a, a whole stack of old school hustler magazines to shit all over him. Yeah, he's a dick. Oh, I love you guys. Thanks. Oh, thanks, Michelle. Is that, is that how you say your name? Michelle? How do you pronounce that? I think that's Michelle. Just Michelle? That works. Michelle. Mitchell, maybe? M Michelle. Michelle. Is there Mich guys? Is there women named Mitchell? Hey there, dudes. Hey, Jamie. Hey, Kiss. Jamie. Um, man, we're popular. This Facebook thing's kind of cool. Jamie Kiss, you have your feet as your uh, picture. That's kind of <laughs> Here, we can put our feet up, too. Don't mind my white legs. I'm wearing shorts, but there's my feet. Jim Bob's feet. He's got socks on. Really, shit stuck to the bottom of my socks. This is what we do. Oh. Yeah, this is... Just drink whiskey. Well, we've been doing that. Yeah. Uh, okay, in case you haven't seen it, this is what we were drinking earlier. It's, it's backwards. They can't read it, Jim Bob. It's backwards. Yeah, it flips. It's, uh... Um, here, can we flip it? No, it doesn't flip that way. Back. Can you see it through the bottle? No. Anyways, it's Teacher's um, Highland Cream. It's, uh, it's from Glasgow, Scotland. We ain't been there, but we got the bottle from there. Yeah, they, they sent it to us. Give a little switcheroo. Oh, a little switcheroo. And this is what we drank earlier. It's backwards, too. It's not Enels like it shows in the screen. It's actually called Slain. And it's a uh, triple cask uh, River Boiny. Boiny. Bo bone. I don't know how the hell you say that, but it's uh, some kind of Irish whiskey. It doesn't taste very good. But it gets you slain. It does get you slain. That's what we've dubbed the name, or dubbed the effects of drinking this whiskey, is you get slain. Wow, why the fuck would you be watching TV right now if you could watch this right here? Yeah, that's my nose that's itchy. Um, that's my seven-year-old feet. So that's your feet when you were seven-year-old? Or that's your seven-year-old's feet? I'm so confused. Oh, yeah. This shit's hard to do, man. We put the slain on the bottom shelf because yeah. it, uh, it's a bottom shelfer. Yeah, it's got bottom shelf bite and it's got bottom shelf flavor. It's not really good. Hey, Joey, I haven't seen you in a while. I hope I'll see you on the 28th at the Outsiders reunion. Oh, yeah. I'm thinking we should take the mountain back by force. Now, I've heard from some people that some of the places, some of the set is still there. So I think if a bunch of us just like. Come Run. as a gang. Yeah, come as a gang. Maybe we'll start, like, we need to get a color. We need to figure out a color. True. A gang color. Get your, get some, some people have chains that'll be swinging around. Most of the colors for gangs are already taken, so maybe, like, uh, maybe our gang color could be Topaz. Topaz, you maybe, might, yeah. Yeah, that could be our gang color. This doesn't sound bad. And we'll just drive, like, RVs up to the damn mountain, and we'll just, you know. <laughs> Fucking Topaz. <laughs> Topaz is our gang color. We'll just drive up to the mountain, take it over. Purple. Yes. Well, purple's already taken. Topaz isn't. So everybody... Get purple. Your, get Purple's your, already taken? Well, what color is what Topaz? What the hell gang's taking purple? Is Topaz purple? Turp... Um... I don't know. <laughs> we don't even know what our gang color is. Uh, we'll Tell us what color Topaz is. Yeah, because I don't really know. You guys are so funny. My son feet, not me. My feet would be on a Polaroid camera. Polaroid, that's some old school shit there. Yeah, oh, Remember that Polaroids. is. I used to know a guy by the name of, uh, I can't say his name because he's on here sometimes. Beige. Beige is Topaz. What the hell color is beige? Is that like tacky? It's like, yeah. Tacky. Tacky, tacky is tacky, oh, not tacky. something. That's something different. Yeah, the ba um, beige gang. Where was that? Polaroid camera. So I knew this guy that had naked pictures of a girl on Polaroid camera. Yeah. And thinking back, it's probably illegal. Because we would have all been underage at the time. Yeah. Oh, man. That's so there's another story for another time. Let's get back to beige. Maybe it's, it's still a, reverse. Hey, we got to stick with Topaz. If I was going to do a ginger, ooh, Jim Bob McClain. If I was going to do a ginger, it'd be Jim Bob McClain. Oh, too. wow. Well, thank you. I'm not doing Jim Bob because that's just gay. That's pretty gay. We don't do that. Wow, that was talking. a really nice comment, though. You're welcome, Jim Bob. <laughs> I mean, I don't mean to call you gay. I'll, I'll no, no, not you. Yeah, yeah. All right, well, still hell. 
So this is what this Facebook Live yeah. is about. Like you oh, just yeah. sit here and talk to people? And people will actually care, I guess. Maybe so if the... you invite somebody and they come on, like, how the hell does that work? Well, I, I don't know, but I did one the other day, and I said, I bet you everybody that's tuning in is th being like, is Jim Bob going to kill himself on camera? <laughs> well, I'm not. I'm not. You know, I'm just doing Why fun stuff. Why would you be killing yourself on camera? <laughs> I don't know. People haven't talked to me oh, in a while. God damn. <laughs> Maybe think I'm going to off myself on Facebook Live. I'm not. What the hell's going on here? It went from a happy thing I mean, to understand how Facebook Everything's works. okay. You're talking about killing yourself. Well, Jim, you know what I mean. Jim, do we need to call a hotline? <laughs> no, no. one 900 save Jim Bob's ass? I'm saying that I'm Is not. Is there a number for that? I'm, I say, I'm saying I'm not going to be killing myself, so, you know, if you guys wanted to see that, I apologize. So how long is your hair now? Well, mine is uh, pretty short. I mean, it's, it's shaved. Yeah. But I figure I can just get a wig. I'm getting those plugs next week put in. Yeah. Jim Bob wants to get, uh, what's that called, cornrows? Yeah. It just don't look right on white people. Once I, I get those them, plugs, though, I'll be rocking it. Like, if you were black, you could rock cornrows, Jim Bob, but you ain't. Remember that girl in, it's um, not your fault. Remember that girl in, uh, Orange is the Next Black? Yeah. She rocked those cornrows, looked pretty cool. She did look pretty damn cool. She's cute. The beard, though, Joey, is, uh, it's, it's getting back here. It's, uh, it's fluffing up. It's looking pretty good. Uh, if you saw it not too long ago, I shaved it all off, but it's coming back. Yeah. The hair, uh, the hair's a different story. I might go with, uh, I don't know, I can't remember how old you are, Joe, but you're not too much younger than us. So you might remember. Just be careful hitting on them, telling them about your hair and fucking. Yeah, I mean, if you want to go out on a date, goddammit, Joe, we'll go out on a date. I don't care, goddammit. But uh, I might, like, I was thinking about doing the step ups. I don't know if you remember that in the 80s. They did like the yeah. lines. Oh, yeah. But it's just, it's not going to work for me. My head's too round. I, my head's kind of like a pumpkin. Yeah. So I don't think that's going to work. So I was thinking about just shaving like around the top. Yeah, under, underneath, let it grow. Let it grow yeah. long. Remember that back Something in the day? Something like that. Get into some mosh pits. You think Joe Harkle? I don't know who that is. You th I'm confused. Hurricane. It sounds like a Japanese guy. He can rock it. Who can rock what? You can probably rock the hairdo. You gotta stay Maybe. up on this shit I'm, or else. I, I start talk. I've been drinking these damn wine coolers because we watched the labyrinth and I figured this is fruit and David Bowie's a fruit. So yeah, I, should probably... I, I don't know if that's a real accepted thing to be saying. <laughs> I don't know if you should <laughs> no, be bragging about they that. They know what I'm saying. <laughs> they know I don't care. If you're a fag, that's on you. I mean... But, uh, where were we? Wow, going into deep things where people are going to get mad at us. That's what we're yeah, doing. I'll get over it. Uh, hell, yeah, hell yeah, me too. Does that mean he's going to... Oh that my mean God. Joe's going to shave his hair like me? I think so. Can Maybe get the step-ups. Shave it around like that? Or the step-ups, maybe? Step-ups. Joe, bumps. what are you talking about, man? <laughs> Jesus. No, as, as, as Fergie said, moderation, moderation, moderation. moderation. And Fergie was referring to meth when she said that. That's true. But it applies to all facets of life. Very true. To moderation. And she has a low-calorie vodka out there that you can buy. She does? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's, it's amazing. Why didn't I know they had low-calorie vodka? Fergie over here. But uh, my favorite man's Rock Bitch, in case anybody's rock concerned. Rock Bitch is something interesting. If you're not aware of Rock Bitch, you need to just YouTube that. It might be on there. Is Rock yeah, Bitch on there? It might be on Pornhub. Hey, I don't know. Relax, dude. Uh, this is all in fun. Joe knows. Wow. Joe's like Bo. What are they? Like is, Bo Jack. I think they're having an argument. Don't. What are you touching things I'm for? I'm trying to Jim see. Bob, you're going to break it. Oh, my. I don't know what the drama is, guys, but we need to cool yeah, it down. Yeah, there's no drama here. We need to cool it down, guys. Joe is an old friend of ours. He was. Uh, he worked with myself on Outsiders. Oh, you know Joe? Yeah, I know Joe. You know Joe, damn it. Oh, Come that's Joe. We have yeah. pictures with him somewhere. Oh, yeah, okay. With him without clothes. I know Joe. So, Joe's been around the block. <laughs> Over a couple times. So, Joe's an old friend of ours. Um, are all those bottles behind you full or empty? They're all full. Um, this is the one we did earlier. This We did a review on this. Um, so, some of them are more yeah. fuller than others. These ones here are... Can you see? Yeah, you can kind of see. These ones here are illegal as shit. Okay. Well, don't be telling them about it. These ones here are legal. legal as shit. Yeah, that's what I said. Because, yeah, they're all full though. Oh, the etiquette book. The etiquette book? Oh, yeah. What about that? We've been meaning to do a series on this. Now, my little lady friend picked this up for me. I don't know if she's trying to tell me something or not, but it says Book of Etiquette. 
Yeah. Now this son of a bitch here, somewhere. Excuse me, I'm a little drunk. Um, has a date? It's 1924. You can't wow. see that. Why am I even showing? 1924. So we were talking about doing some episodes where we read from this book. So test it out. Okay. Um, the bride's veal, veal, veal. Like we, cow, we, baby cow. We need to learn how to read first. Yeah, reading is kind of important when you do well, these let's things. let's hear about this lady's veil. According to the marriage rites of the, of the ancient Hebrews, ordained in days when marriage itself was an unknown in many countries. A canopy must be held over the bride and groom for intimate friends of the family. Well, this is a damn this sex book. Boring. Later, we find that this is custom among early Hebrews. Passage by, passaged an Anglo-Saxon custom of erecting... Oh, shit. Erections. This damn book's a por- My girl got me a porno book. I wow. ain't any more of that. Not in front of Jimbo. Yeah. You know, he might try to touch me in funny places. I definitely won't. I hope not. All right, right here. This is, uh... This here's a favorite of mine. This is Rob... M- M- we don't know how to spell it. Or say it. WGN Moonshine is on top shelf. Good stuff. That stuff is really good. It's up there. That's uh, me and Sarah for special occasions. This Rod Majod. Majod. This stuff here is a new bottle we got. This is from Denmark. Yeah. Um, it's made out of clay. Yeah. You know, that's how we do it. This is uh, also from the same people that made the Vikings blood, which is up top there. You probably can't see it. Either. It's just like sipping Vikings blood. But this shit here, there's a bottle. Whew, that stinks. It's... Okay, the bottle's a little dirty. Or the, not the, the bottle, but the glass is a little dirty. But it's good stuff anyway. Tastes like apples. <laughs> it's not so good when it's not a clean bottle. Apples and assholes. I'm trying to figure it out. It has a real wooden cork too, which is unusual. But this shit here was amazing. It was a good buy. Highly recommend it. Yeah, that's pretty. That's pretty intense. Yeah, it helps pretty, whenever oh. it's not, and when it's in a clean glass. Yeah. Wow. God damn. Make me sweat a little bit. Yeah. So August this is what 28th. we're doing with their lives. August twenty eighth, Joe. You will see us there. I don't think I even told Jim Bob about it yet, but he'll be there because he doesn't have a choice. I'll just tie like him it. up. I'll come. Whatever. Um, no, the bottles are not empty. The Outsiders Moonshine. Uh, that's called it. Uh, Feral Shine. I think it's called. Them bottles are full, not open. We drank our other bottles, but those ones are being saved. Um, um, I'm a little drunk, so reading's not my strong point right now. I work at a place that carries the old Smoky 100% for our mixed drinks. It's yummy. Oh, yeah. Yes, that's it we, is. That's what we like over here, Do yummy. we have any more? No, we have the Firefly Moonshine. <laughs> I don't think we have any more old Smoky material. But I am going to Tennessee here in the end of October, early November. So I'll be visiting the Old Smoky Distillery, and I will bring some stuff out. Are you are you allowed to do that? Or do you have to smuggle it? Doesn't matter. Wow. Illegal. Jim Bob, damn it, I'm a rebel, you know that. You are a rebel. All right, August 28th, then. Yes, Joe, I will see you there. Jamie, I don't think we could send anything because Pennsylvania law, as we just found out, now only allows you to send. It's probably always been this way. Hell, I don't know. They only allow you to send up to 20%, I think, 20% by alcohol volume or some shit so. like that yeah. over through the mail. So if you go on to Wine Anthology, Wineanthology, Wineanthology.com, that's where we got the Vikings blood and the Rye Majod, Majod, Majod. Majod stuff. How much was that stuff? Uh, it was like 25 bucks a bottle maybe. Wasn't too bad. Wasn't too bad. And it's worth every penny. So I definitely recommend that. Big Jim's on. Hi, Jim. How you doing? Oh, Big Jim. I saw you put a thing up where you stopped uh, you stopped delivering fuel, and you're starting to feel better. You're getting health benefits from that. It's very good. I thought you were going to say, uh, stop the car with his bare hands. He's probably, you, you've <laughs> met Jim. You yeah. know he could. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Jim is a damn Sasquatch. Yeah, in a good way. In a good way. If there was cool a stuff. Sasquatch that was like a giant, it would be Jim. Really? I yeah. mean, when it boils down to it. I'm sorry, Jim. We're really drunk. We've been doing videos and drinking and reviewing, and it's just what happens. So, Joe, you see Jim's here. And you hit Jim, Joe, oh, too many J's. Joe agrees that Jim could probably stop a car with his hands. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 
It's I better put all my money on it. What do you think the lag is here? Like when we're saying shit, how long do we see? Yeah, I think, there, yeah, I think like, there is, is a little lag. Immediate? I think there's uh, a lag. Oh, Jim, there is. It's up top here. Um, there's a model up here. And you see there's, there's one There's an open one? That's the unopened one. Oh, shit, this one's about empty. Wow, look. Where the hell is the other one? Where'd the WPN go? I don't know. Oh, yeah, WPN's gone. This one's, um... It's, uh... That one's pretty empty. So, uh... Yeah. Jim Bob might have been drinking out of the one we're supposed to be saving. Yeah, that stuff's a little rough. I think I got a couple bottles somewhere else hidden just for good saving. Yep, for the apocalypse, for yeah. the zombie apocalypse. Jimmy, do you still got the ones I got you? Are they, are they safe or did you drink them? Either way, it's okay. It's okay either way, but... Hey, what's the thread count on everybody's sheets at home? You guys got some nice sheets? Thread count? <laughs> <laughs> I don't fucking I'm asking. These are uh, streaming questions. You gotta ask him questions. Altman Bigfoot. Tristan, there is an Altman Bigfoot. Yep. We've researched them. There's all. Wow. We've found clues. Yep. But the son of a bitch is elusive. We do have another video coming out. Uh, Jim Ball's been working on. It's from day one of our Bigfoot hunting till now. Up to the alien hunting. Yeah. And then back to the Bigfoot hunting Explain again. Explain that. You know more than yeah, I do. It's just, uh, I, I walked in at the end of it. Well, I'll just be real quick because this is fucking amazing. This is the best thing you're ever going to hear. Um, so at the beginning, we heard that there was a Bigfoot sighting in Pennsylvania. We went and checked it out. Then we heard that there was an alien sighting around the same area. We went and checked it out. And through this, we found out the Bigfoots may have a connection to aliens. We checked that out. It's possible. Yep, we did our uh, third Bigfoot hunt. Uh, you guys can watch that. It's called the Bigfoot Ooh, hunt or something. That was a work. Yeah, I had a couple of things come up on a couple of cool. Um So, yeah, that's, that's what I was saying. That's there was funny. a little Sixers pizza in that one. Yeah, oh, yeah. Sixers pizza, if you don't know, is pretty damn good, so I highly recommend it. Uh, before that, comments disappeared. Uh, nope. Walmart special sheets, do they have a count? I, I don't know. Wait, what does that say? I saw Jim said, oh, you can do that? Oh, you yeah. Can scroll back. Walmart special Son sheets. Of a bitch. Do they have a count? I don't Jim know. Jim said something. He had nine bottles left. That's good for you, Jim. There's no way I can keep that many bottles Full. There's just no way. Um, what else did I miss? They here? say Bigfoot's in Linesville. Where the hell's Linesville at? I don't know. Is that PA? I caveman tried to look for him. I, I don't. A caveman no. tried to look for him. <laughs> caveman tried to look for him. <laughs> probably heading. I'm bad at reading. My eyes are yeah. so damn bad. You uh, do the Probably heading to either Harrisburg or Philly tonight. Take care. Jimmy, you have a good trip. You be safe, man. That's right. I will see you on the 28th. I think it's the 28th. Whatever the hell the Outsiders reunion is, I'll see you there. Uh, 300 thread count are comfy. Oh, what yeah. The, hell does the that sheets. But talk about the sheets. Thanks. Thank you very much. Uh, 300, you said? Yeah, because, uh, you know, I hear people with these 1,000 death rate counts. I'm like, what the fuck are these guys doing? You don't need 1,000 for death count. I don't know. What's the difference? It makes them softer or something. I'm just trying to strike up conversation. Explain to me out there why Jim Bob knows so much about the thread count of sheets. That's... Well, because, you know... You I'm, took a little too much in when you watched I like the be, I like to be comfortable. No, <laughs> no. no. he was rubbing off on no. you, wasn't he? No, he wasn't. Or wearing off or what? All right. Oh, my God. I'm late. Ch oh, my God. She's late, Jim Bob. Nobody wants to ever hear a woman say that. My badness. I'm late. Oh, so wait, man. So, you're not late? Like, late is in you're having a little baby? I'm so confused right now. Uh, wow. Where I have a 1,500 uh, thread count. Egyptian cotton. Holy Matt shit. Is that Tharp. even a real? Wow. Matt Tharp. He's ordering that shit from uh, his customer. How the hell that. do you get that many threads? In, I'm, I'm That's real. Long. Y'all can have all the thread count discussions you want. I have no idea what the hell you're talking about. When people about. start talking Egyptian fabrics, where is the reunion? Shut the, hell uh, up. the reunion. Uh, I don't know. Go oh, on Facebook and you're look You're not up. pregnant. No, thank God you're not pregnant. I'm proud of you. Yeah, unless you want to have a baby, then I, that sucks, and we yeah, hope you have a baby. Yeah, then just play more. Um, <laughs> the reunion is uh, it's on. I, I'm not 100% sure, so don't quote me on this. But it's okay. something to do with the. Jim Bob left me. You son of a bitch left me. Anyways, the reunion, if you look on Facebook, type in Outsiders Reunion or some shit. I don't know. It's probably on my page somewhere. I don't know. But uh, I think it's the 28th. It's in Monroeville, Pennsylvania. And I'm not sure if it's on the set where we shot or what the hell's going on. 
I don't know. Oh my god, hell no. Trying to keep up with the comments. I play. Don't worry about that. I'm surprised. Just shared too much. I'm just surprised so many people what, were on ears? here. I think one of them bugs got my ear. I think I got a bug in my ear. Why the? It's building a home up in there. It might be. Oh, shared too much. Nope, no bugs. There's one right there. Right there. I didn't get Got it. these fucking gnats. Gnats are coming out of the woodworks. Um, all right, Jamie, I will send you an invite. Thank you, Joe. I appreciate that because I can't remember shit. <clears throat> all right, I gotta find a drink. Oh man, he left me. Well, I guess I'll do my juggling act. It's not the gym bomb show. Don't get dirty. I've got up to juggling twelve things. I was juggling this knife. I'll juggle this glass right here. Um, <clears throat> I'm juggling. Jim Bob, don't Louis. be doing shit. You're gonna hurt. What else do we have that's uh, deadly? We need to find some more deadly stuff. Let's see. I got that stuff. We'll keep... Yeah, we want Louie in there. Um, let's see. I'll juggle this real nice pair of uh, official Elvis glasses that I bought online at eBay. Um, ow! Hit my funny bone. <laughs> it's not really funny. Um, we'll, juggle, we'll juggle this big-ass bottle right here. That's a full bottle. We'll juggle that. All right, the door open. Oh, we'll juggle this alligator head with, sh with yeah, shells well, inside of it. How do you have all that shit all over the table? Here, we'll juggle that. All right, you ready? Why oh, you shit, he I came got, back. I can't juggle now. I got a bottle now. of water because I thought it might be healthy. Well, you guys, sorry, guys. I was going to juggle, but Jim Bob has ruined it. problems when it comes to showboating. He likes to do it too much. There's Louie. Louie's back. Yep. Uh, Emily's watching. Hi, Emily. Haven't seen you in about 100 years. Just screw up and see my long comment. What's a long comment? Well, it's a. Did you put a picture of his penis on there? Let's hope not. Let's get this alligator away. We're going to scare people. Where the hell does this go? Is it. I'm in Lionsville, PA. It's where I'm from. And they showed up here because they want proof. They There was proof of Bigfoot. Because in Lionsville, there's, they had a okay. Bigfoot. I think is what he's saying. If that's the right one. So people were coming to Lionsville to see if they can find Bigfoot. And you're in Lionsville. Okay. I think we're I think we're caught up. Okay. Um Oh yeah. I'm sure there ain't any bug in that water bottle. No, I just opened this water. It's still pretty I mean it's pretty much the top layer. I just opened it. I swear there's no vlog in here. I got to sober up for the night. I can't sleep when I'm drunk. It's a pain in the ass. Yeah, yeah. It's real hard to drive when you're drunk. That's right. Which we don't think you should do. I don't see. Yes, I Now. Jim Bob's new. He's all excited about this vaping world. Hey, I quit bullshit. smoking. I'm just happy I quit smoking. And I'm proud of him for quitting smoking. But I'm smoking it's, still. It's a pain in the ass when you smoke. But... That's Pistachio ice chasing, cream. Chasing the cloud is just one step closer to chasing the dragon. Too, yeah, well. That's true. I mean, next thing you know, you're going to be sucking slope. dick for opium. No. It's that's, just the way it happens. It's a slippery slope. That's what I've heard. I don't know what the fuck he's that's talking about. That's what I've heard. Cool. Louie agrees. <laughs> cool. <laughs> oh, shit. All right. Oh, you got to go. All right, Joe. GGY. We're going to have to look that up on yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. See you later, Joey. Take see care. See you later. We'll see you in uh, a couple weeks. Vaping ain't bad. See that? Vaping is just weird. Good for you, Jim Bob. See, somebody else cares about your well-being. Exactly. All right. It helped me. Um, the opium or the, the vaping? The vaping. Oh, okay. Yeah, that right. would make more sense. Yeah, really, yeah. In the grand scheme of things. All right. Well, it's got to be getting late. I don't know what the hell time it is. Yeah. How do you end these things? Uh, you just say bye. That's it? Yeah. You say goodbye? But you try to catch up on everybody. I think we're good on everybody. We're, we're going to do this more often because this is pretty, pretty fucking cool. It is kind of cool. Yeah, after a day I of guess shooting. it's a good way to interact with people. So we got beer reviews coming up. Let's we got uh, whiskey reviews coming up. Whiskey reviews. We got the Labyrinth uh, video coming soon. That's very true. We don't all smell like ashtrays now. When I quit smoking. Very true. It took me about a week to notice I didn't smell cigarettes anymore. When Jim Bob quit smoking, it took about two days, and I realized, hey, the studio don't smell like cigarettes yeah, anymore. Yeah, that stuff's nasty. So it is pretty damn nice. 
Uh, I'll let you know when you're going Bigfoot hunt. We can do that. We've been talking about it. Uh, yeah. People want to know what the next well, step is for Bigfoot. But see, the thing is, though, when we, we went out there, I got pulled into the woods, and there was this sticky stuff all over my pants yeah. if you watch the video. So, well, you know, I kind of don't want to go back into the woods and do that again. You know, you could probably understand. But I'm sure with enough drugs, we can talk him into it. So it's not a problem. Very true. Eat some of those mushrooms I ate in the uh, Create Utopia video. Yeah, it makes sense. All right, so uh, whiskey reviews, beer reviews, got the Labyrinth movie review. Um, will it stop a bullet? We're yeah. probably going to be stu shooting that maybe tomorrow. Very true. Maybe tomorrow, maybe a day after, something like that. And the... Uh, We're at the 223 caliber. Oh, yeah, 223. Um, I don't know what it's got to go through, but it's got to go through. An amp, a couple things. Yeah. Oh, I got that resonator off the Polaris stuff, the Razor. Then whenever I bought a new one, yeah, and I fucking fried it, so I had to buy another one. So the old one I just fried is gonna get shot because we need to see if it'll stop the bullet. I mean, it might come and play for Jim Bob's body armor. It's true. I'm gonna be building a full body armor suit um, when we're done with this and uh, testing it. So yeah, I might die. So definitely check out the channel. That's right. He probably isn't gonna test it because that probably would just not. be dumb. Yeah, I'm not people have actually died doing that dumb shit. But hey, uh, by saying that you might kill yourself, <laughs> people don't say you're gonna kill yourself. I'm not, I'm That's not. how people get called, and they you're, show up to your house wearing white coats and they right. haul you away. I'm just kidding, but you know, this show, Whiskey Drinker channel on YouTube, is very dangerous. Just <laughs> yeah, it is. Just watch yeah. it. Watch you never know what's gonna happen. Exactly. If you're not 21. Um, that's okay, because you only have to be 18 in the United States to watch a bunch of dumb shit. That's true, all those cuss words we say. We try not to swear, but we don't try very hard not to swear. That's right. All right, well, we'll, we'll see you next time. So this is uh, signing off. This is Clint. This is Jim Bob. And we'll see you later. That's right. Thanks for watching, guys. All right.